Virgo. Um, Virgos are a mutable sign with a negative polarity. Virgo is also an earth sign like Taurus. Uh, so earth signs in general tend to be very grounded, very stable. Um, they don't like change. They like things to have structure and order. Virgos in particular like in, in particular like that structure and order, organizing things. Um, they're very analytical. They want to nitpick at every little thing. They can be very judgy. Um, <clears throat> so they, if you talk to a Virgo, they're not going to make you aware, but they're judging everything you're saying and doing and uh, the way you're dressed. Um, Virgo's making mental notes of it. Um, Virgos aren't superficial in any sense, and Virgos are very logical thinkers. So if you can approach a Virgo from a logical way or perspective, or break things out like in numbers or orders, uh, uh, bullets, anything like that, Virgos will eat that up. It's probably the best way to communicate with a Virgo. Um, they say that Virgos tend to be very neat um, and like cleanliness. Uh, they also say that Virgos tend to be pretty bad in bed uh, or boring in bed or not very sexual. Um, I think it kind of depends on the other planetary alignments. So if you have a Scorpio moon or a Leo moon, you might be a more sexually charged Virgo than your standard Virgo. But if you have double earth in there, then I wouldn't really fuck with them. <laughs> Virgos are my best friends, I'd say. A lot of my really good close friends are Virgos. I love Virgos to death. Um, and my moon's in Virgo, and it's it's really nice to have a problem and take it to a Virgo, and they're just gonna pick it apart. And it's like, wow, thanks so much for listening. And they will be impartial. So Virgos are definitely, um, a sign that pairs very well with water signs. Virgos would pair well with uh, a Cancer or a Pisces, um, possibly a Capricorn, uh, but that might be too much Earth. Um, but in general, Virgos are very solid folks. Virgos love to serve and to be of service. They want to help you out. They want to do you a favor. Um, if you need something, a Virgo will more likely be there for you. Um, and they will try to fix problems for you or tell you how to fix your problems, um, even when you're not really asking for it. Uh, but that's just how the Virgo's mind works. It's not really like they're judging you in that moment they just really want everyone around them to be better they want you to be better they want themselves to be better and they'll take feedback uh, because they want to always self-improve 